The Ghana Atomic Energy Commission support for technical and vocational education and training, DVET, has led to the training of over 100 individuals in self-employed skills. Deputy Director General of the Commission, Professor Dixon Adomako, highlighted the importance of TVET and its contribution to sustainable development. To train the female in the area of hands-on training, it helps in every sphere of the economy because if the ladies are able to get this entrepreneurship and able to extend it back home, they are actually going to help their family and extended family. Tivet institutions are encouraged to strive to build their credibility by effective training of other students and contribute towards career development. Deputy Director General of the Commission for TVET, Engineer Peter Entry Bosiakon, said the system can be a game changer in reducing structural unemployment and supply the labor market with skilled workers. Everywhere in the world, they are all investing into TVET because you go to the traditional university and you come out having a degree. Employers are not looking for degrees and certificates you have. Employers are looking for competence and skills. So it's not about your degree. It's about what you can do with your hands and your head. Programs Manager for Campaign for Remake Education Ghana, Emmanuel Eko Idriafo, noted the need for reorientation on fields perceived to be for men. The IT, the welding, the, the farming, it's, it's male-dominated. So we wanted spaces where the males are dominating for the females to be able to also be able to dominate.